I got started in 2010, um, and at the time I was living in rural Georgia, and just to put a pin on the map, I was an hour from Honey Boo Boo, so it really was a culture shock for me because I come from more like urban environments, and I was there because my husband, we had just gotten married, and he was stationed there as a naval officer for a, a submarine. So I found myself in rural Georgia and I just graduated with a degree in economics and business and I started working in financial planning and I quickly realized that I didn't like it and I was far too stubborn to spend any extended length of time doing something I didn't love. So I emailed him and he was deployed at the time and I said, I don't want to work in finance, I want to do something I love, and I love food. And he wrote back from the depths of the ocean, and he told me to go for it. So at the time, I was like, what do I do? I love food, but there's not really a lot of food opportunity around. And so I decided I'd start this really trendy thing at the time called a food blog. And I figured that it would be kind of a bridge to the next job and serve as a portfolio, because I knew the Navy would be moving us in a, in a year or two, but it really took off early on the traffic picked up and I realized that it wasn't the bridge to another job it was my job and I started treating it as such and um, today seven years later it's a six-figure business and fully supports my family and it's traveled in each move of the Navy so it's just been an incredible opportunity it's evolved so much since it started and it's just been so much fun